So now we are about to link MATCAD and TRIO. So to link these two, you go in Analysis, Prime Analysis, then the window opens. Then you go Load File, you load your MATCAD file. You select your file and click Open. And then you auto map. If it doesn't work, you go on the green plus and you add manually your parameters. But with AutoMap, it selects automatically the parameter with the same name and it shows it in the table. So as you can see, it had been added in the Creo Parametric to Prime table. Then in the Prime to Creo Parametric table, you go on the blue rectangle, right click, select Prime Output. You select all your outputs and you go OK, then Compute. So you go add feather, you name it as you want, like analysis test. Then close. So now you go on model, model intent, relations, and you go on local parameter and you click in filter by and you select current and all sub levels. You write L equals and you select the corresponding parameter, you multiply it by the scale. You write H, you do the same, equal, and you select the parameter corresponding to it. You can find the good parameters because uh, you have in, in the fourth column its value and you can compare it with the value in the MATCAD prime file. You do the same for the width. So W equals to other corresponding parameter and you multiply it by scale. Now you go OK. Right click on analysis test and next. So then it opens your MATCAD prime file. So it loads it and when it's finished you click on compute. The after you click on OK, so it regenerates with the value from MATCAD. So you have to regenerate two times. This software is very long to regenerate, so you have to wait. Now you can check the value are the same in MATCAD. Trio shows only three decimals, and I have set my model in meter, kelvin, and seconds. So we can't see the millimeters, but it's present because you can see the um, thickness of the beam. So after checking, you click OK, it regenerates, you wait. To modify values, you go on Analysis Test, right click, Edit Definition, Next and you open your MATCAD file and you could change values. So now we can change the um, MATCAD prime values. So we change L like 0 0.3, H 20 millimeters, and width equals 5 millimeters. After changing, you save your MATCAD prime file and you compute your Prime analysis. So you can see in this column the values that have changed. You go close, you go OK, and it regenerates. You have to regenerate once again.
So you see the shape of the beam isn't the same. You can check the values have changed. Okay. You can do the same for the extrusion. So you go right click edit definitions. Okay and you can see this value has also changed so this video show you how to parameter your Creo model with your Matcat Prime worksheet I hope this video is clear and everything is understandable